Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Avery, and today I'm going to be talking about all of the ebooks that I ended up downloading in June. Baby, baby. I downloaded all of these books for free, or they were on Kindle Unlimited, but I'm pretty sure all of these are free. I don't think I got them off of Kindle Unlimited. Some of them may be on Kindle Unlimited, but I purchased them for free. Before I get started, I want to address a couple things. First off, sorry if you can hear a fan in the background. Um, I don't know if you can or not. <laughs> But if you can, I am sorry. It is very hot in Texas at the moment, so I love fans also, so anyway. Um, also, I am wearing glasses. I apologize for the really, 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 really bad glare, obviously. And the next pair that I get, it's gonna be blue light. <laughs> These obviously are not. So if you don't know, I actually have a chronic illness and uh, in the past couple weeks, because I've been, the videos you've been seeing were pre-filmed. Um, in the past couple like two weeks or so a new symptom has come up with my chronic illness Apparently, this is a symptom that pops up in a lot of POTS patients. I have POTS if you didn't know and um, It's where you get dry flaky peely skin All around your eyes all around um, So it started in the corners of my eyes and then it slowly went up and down so it's it's all around my eyes right now. I don't like it and um I honestly, I'm trying to find a dermatologist to help me with this because um, my eye doctor could not help me because she's not a dermatologist. It has nothing to do with my eyes. It has to do with the skin around my eyes. Um, so I'm trying to fix that. Uh, and I personally don't like the way that it looks when I put makeup on top of it. It makes me look like I'm a lizard peeling skin. Like it's gross. And y'all don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. So I'm going to have to endure wearing glasses for videos for a little bit um, or until I don't care anymore and put on makeup. There's two different sides to me. <laughs> there are points where I care and there are some days where I'm like, I don't care, deal with it, whatever. Today, I did not want to do, put on makeup, so there, there you go. Um, you may see me like this in the next couple videos. You may not, whatever. It depends on what my mindset is like right now. I don't want to see my skin peel off of my face while wearing makeup. Like, no. Anyway, y'all don't want to hear me rant about this. So let's talk about all of the ebooks I ended up downloading last month. Okay, you guys, let's get started. The first book that I downloaded in June was The Dominator, which is a dark mafia romance by Dee Dee Prince. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited, or you can purchase it for $3.99. I've been ripped from my life and handed over to become property of Tommy Ferrano. I'm horrible at pronouncing names if you did not know. A criminal who is beautiful outside but inside, but ugly inside. He has three rules for me. One, obey. Two, tell no one anything about him. Rule three gives me a peek into just how depraved, alpha, and possessive he really is. My life is about to be twisted up in knots. He will hurt me, love me, set my body on fire with passion or he will kill me. Next, we have Hers Untamed, a science fiction romance by Anna Adler. This is still available to download for free. Alyssa Cressfield always wanted a pet, a big sexy man who would look impressive on a leash. Now she is finally ready to realize her dream. She visits a pet training center intending to buy a trained pet until instead she finds Jax, a fierce human alien hybrid freshly caught from space, still untamed and unbroken. Eliza has never encountered an untamed pet before. She can't resist temptation. She must have him. On Selenia, it is customary for humans to keep other intelligent species as pets and toys. Alyssa is kind at heart, but she is a product of her society and therefore sees nothing wrong with keeping a man in a cage against his will. Jax, on the other hand, is a space pirate who now finds himself himself wearing a collar and being treated like property. He has no intention of turning tame and obedient. And a battle of wills ensues. Jax and Alyssa quickly discover their undeniable chemistry, but is it enough to reconcile them? What happens when the pet breaks out of his cage? Next, I have Falling for Your Best Friend's Twin. A Sweet Romantic Comedy by Emma St. Clair. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you can purchase it for $3.99. There are a million and one reasons not to fall for her best friend's twin. Too bad love isn't reasonable. He may make her geeky heart beat faster, but Abby's crush on Zane needs to die. Not only is he her best friend's twin, an epic violation of friend code, but he's her total opposite. Oh. And right now, he's also her client. Zane's startup has enough headaches. He doesn't need the added stress of having his sister's irritatingly adorable friend taking over his office and getting under his skin. 
in more ways than one. His company's launch may rest on Abby's shoulders, but the cost to Zane's sanity and his heart may be too high. When Abby and Zane are forced together on an investor's weekend, the lines blur between business and personal, between friendship and something more. Can this button-up businessman and quirky coder take a risk on love despite the odds? Then I have Sins of a King by Emma Slate. This is available to purchase for $3.99. I can't breathe without him. Playboy, billionaire, criminal. I should hate him for what he's done to me, but I'm powerless to resist him. His touch engulfs me. His demands conquer me. But Flynn Campbell isn't who I thought he was. Suddenly, I'm thrust into a world of seduction and sin. Ensnared by danger and power, foreign desires burn within me. It's time to embrace the darkness and become a queen. Then I have Follow My Lead by Lisa Renee Jones. Uh, this is available to purchase for $4.99. After the roaring success of the first season, the pressure is on America's most popular reality dance show, and no one is feeling it as much as guest judge and TV presenter Darla James. This opportunity should make her career soar or sink, but when her nemesis, the very hot and infuriating Blake Nelson, is asked to join the show too, Darla wonders exactly what she signed up for. But the sparks on camera and off between Darla and Blake are brighter than a Georgia firecracker, and the tension between them has turned into wicked mind-blowing melt your brain. Starts with an S, you know. Anyway, um, if anyone finds out, it will be the end of both of their reputations and the scandal of the tele television season. Then again, with chemistry like theirs, it might be worth it. I then have Focused, a hate to love sports romance by Carla Sorensen. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you could purchase it for $4.99. You know the hot neighbor boy you crushed on all your teenage years? Imagine him 10 years later and he turns out to be a complete jerk. Then you know how I feel. Our last encounter was awkward, given I'd climbed up into his bedroom window to turn my unrequited crush into something requited. That day was bad enough, but things just got worse. Noah Griffin turned himself into one of the best football players in the country and transferred to the Washington Wolves. The team I work for lands him on my doorstep. The timing couldn't be worse because my boss just handed me the opportunity of a lifetime and that promotion rides squarely on Noah's big, muscular, condescending shoulders. He wants nothing to do with me and the feeling is very mutual, but for the sake of my career, I can ignore all those things about him that drive me insane. His eyes, his mouth, his big, big hands. Until one day, we can't ignore them anymore. You know what they say about the lines between love and hate, though. They're also very right. Then I downloaded Chameleon by uh, Cara Bristol. This is available to purchase for $3.99. When you wish upon a falling star or a, a UFO, young widow Kevan Garardi catches sight of a meteorite streaking across the sky and wishes for a good handyman to help her with her rundown lavender farm and make it a big success. Instead, she gets a shape-shifting alien who apparently has never seen a leaky faucet before, but his loving and noble spirit makes him just the man to fix her wounded heart. He hasn't promised her forever, but a girl can hope, can't she? Maybe she'll make another wish. When his ship tumbles out of the sky and lands on Earth, Chameleon never expects to fall for a human woman. Unfortunately, he can't stay. He made a mistake that led to the devastation of an entire planet, and now the survivors are depending on him to get them to safety. He must repair his ship and leave before the Xeno Corstrium finds him and Earth becomes endangered too. But oh, he wishes he could stay with Kavan forever. Can a twist? of fate make their wishes come true. Then I downloaded Man on Top by Laura Lynn Page. This is available to download for free still. This is actually um, a little sneak peek into the first chapter of, or first couple chapters of a book that I read in um, June as well. So like if you want to read the book series that I talked about in June, um, maybe check out this book because it is free and see if you actually want to purchase it because um, that's what I did and I really liked that book. So Anyway, this is the free little freebie that's just the first couple chapters of the book. And it says, It was Tiana's idea to crash a Sebastian's party, once in a lifetime and all that. Which is why I snuck in, even after she got sick and bailed, though it really isn't fun without her. Until I ended up on the rooftop with the most stupid hot guy on the planet, and when he offers to take me home, I can't imagine telling Tiana I turned him down. So I'll be Cinderella for a party, a very wicked girl in the bedroom. After that, I'll disappear into the daylight without even an exchange of names. I don't belong in his world. One night is all we get. 
Unless, of course, fate has other plans. Then I downloaded Neuron Rising, a space fantasy romance by Kiari Taylor. I'm probably butchering that. I am so sorry. Um, this is still available to download for free. In the Eon Galaxy, Dominion controls any planet with solid neuron deposits. And Nova just found out they're coming for hers. Corpilion isn't supposed to have any neuron, the galaxy's purest form of energy, but Nova Ainsley has been working with the owner of a secret mine for months, building highly illegal weapons that can wield neuron. She wants off Corpilion, and selling these weapons will buy her and her father a ticket to another planet in the galaxy. Neuron is incredible on its own, but there are those who can wield it to their will, granting them the ability to read minds, see the future, and destroy worlds, the Nero. But this is a galaxy where they are ceasing to exist, and Dominion owns the last one in the known universe, using him to take over and destroy billions of lives. An encounter with the last Nero shows Nova her future. It's with him. She will stand by his side one day, her fingers laced through his, love and adoration in both of their eyes. A dark queen and his evil pawn king. Fate or destiny, Nova will do anything it takes to change the future and that of the galaxy. Then I downloaded The Devil in the Deep Blue Sea by Amelia Wilde. This is still available to download for free. A modern day pirate, an heiress lost at sea, and the treasure of a lifetime. He's beautiful, calculating, cruel, and he's taken me hostage. When pirates board my boyfriend's yacht, I jump overboard to save myself drifting a sea until one man rescues me from the endless ocean. Except he has plans of his own. I'm worth too much money for ransom. He'll keep me on his ship and in his bed. The real danger lies in the dark in his dark depth eyes. He wants more from me than money, than passion. He wants everything. He rescued me, but I'm far from safe. There's an entire sea of danger threatening to drag me under. Then we have The Exiled Prince by Jana E. Mann, and this is still available to download for free. One night, no names, no faces. It should have been simple. I've never been reckless with my heart until I meet a handsome stranger at a secret masquerade ball. From the glint in his eyes, he knows I don't have an invitation. I'm not rich or a celebrity. I'm just the personal assistant of someone important. Instead of showing me the door, he ex- he ex- ex I can't ever say that word escorts escorts me through the gardens and into a world of decadence, sin, and forbidden pleasures. From the moment we meet, I can't stop thinking about him, the way his hands feel on my hips, the press of his hard chest against mine. Everything about this night is a sham except for the way he owns my body. Tomorrow I'll go back to being normal and let this and forget this ever happened. Tonight I'm going to live it up. Except this isn't the ending. It's just the beginning. A few months later, my new boss is the billionaire exiled prince from the masquerade and I'm in serious trouble. Next is 1462 South of Broadway um, by Casey Decker. This is still available to download for free. It is said that a bird never has to doubt the stability of her branch because her trust is in her own wings. I myself am trying to grow wings of my own, but I'm kind of mired in place right now. My roommate fondly calls my situation a rut and seems to think he knows how I can climb out of it. The problem with his solution is that he's stone cold crazy. There is no way in hell I'm going to a, starts with an S, club. <laughs> Next we have Catching the Cowboy by Kennedy Fox. This is still available to download for free. Settling down and starting a family is something Diesel has considered, regardless of his one night stand reputation. However, he might be single forever since who he wants is off limits his best friend's little sister. He's been in love with her for years, but betraying his friendship could ruin everything. Rowan Bishop is over men, especially after finding out her boyfriend cheated and left her ho brokenhearted. After graduating from college, she's back home and has to face the one guy who purposefully gets under her skin, her older brother's best friend. She hates that she's attracted to him, but she's willing to fight for who she wants. Spending time together is a bad idea, but neither can deny the chemistry sizzling between them. Late night talks turn into spontaneous adventures in just when Rowan's willing to admit how she truly feels, Diesel's past catches up with him and ruins their perfect, picture-perfect romance. One secret turns into another, and before either can grasp their new reality, more truths unravel, threatening to expose their forbidden relationship. Then I have Three Simple Rules by Nikki Sloan. This is still available to download for free. I would do anything for my dream job. Now I have to. In order to save my skin at the office, I'm forced to sell it as an exclusive and illegal blindfold club. He paid thousands of dollars for one night to own me, but when my blindfold comes off, I want more. More nights, more rules, and more 
from this unavailable and uncompromising man. Rule number one, no questions. Rule number two, no lies. But rule number three, that's the hardest one to obey. I then downloaded Always by Bethany Chris. This is still available to download for free. A Wild Boy, A Sly Girl. Cross, Don... His name's Cross. There you go, I can't pronounce the last name. Defines trouble. He does what he wants because he's never known anything different. He's unapologetic and he owns it. Catherine Marcello is every bit a good girl on the outside. Her entire world is a legacy and she lives it. She's curious and she's exploring it. She chases bad things. He never learned to be good. Their late nights, stolen cars, first times, fist fights, leather jackets, beaches, bloody smiles, and life. They're vicious and precious and dangerous and harmless, innocence and sin. They're love. Love is killing for someone and love is living for someone. Sometimes you can't save your heart when it means sacrificing it too. Sometimes you have to learn to save yourself. Sometimes love has to fall, crash, and burn. This is what love is like when you're a princip and principessa della, ma della mafia. I probably just mispronounced all that, but this is what love is like when you're cross, don't, Dante, I don't know, and Catherine Marcello. And lastly, in June, I downloaded Billionaire Factor Bryce by uh, Scarlett Avery. This is a billionaire romance, age gap romance, and the man is older. The main reason why I downloaded this is because the author's name is like my name, but it's backwards and it's spelled differently. My name is Avery Scarlett. Like, that's my middle name is Scarlett. Um, and so Scarlett is spelled right, Avery is spelled incorrectly but um it's kind of like my name flipped so i thought that was really cool that's the main reason why i downloaded this i didn't even read the summary because i just thought that was really cool <laughs> but this is available to download off of kindle unlimited or you could purchase it for 3.99 my back is up against the wall he's an uncompromising billionaire i have one card left to play desperation once i had it all then i made a fateful mistake that cost me everything on the brinks of financial disaster i'm forced to rebuild my life now i'm about to meet bryce a Silicon Valley trailblazing billionaire in the Big Apple for business. A man who never takes no for an answer. A man who knows what he wants. A man who gets what he wants. Sometimes in life, desperation is the only card you have left to play. So there you have it. Those are all of the books that I ended up downloading in June for free. Please let me know down below if you've read any of these books or if you want to. But anyways, thank you all so, so much for watching. I will see you all soon in my next one. Bye, y'all.